Yeah. You got something to say? I got a lot to say, actually. <laughs> Getting a shot here at the big money wing thing. The big money win. Only problem is I gotta use the little hand. <laughs> That's how you pay back Big Daddy for talking crap. You make him put the hand missing fingers into the cash cube to play. If I could grab one, this is gonna be a miracle. <laughs> so for every one, Jay said he's gonna give me a thousand dollars. Absolutely. Yeah. Alright, all the way into the bicep. Oh, oh here we go. One and a two. Not a damn thing. I can't feel anything yet. <laughs> Let's get a close up of those fingers through the glass, sir. <laughs> oh, he got one. <laughs> uh, good, good thing you don't need that uh, fingers to steer your <laughs> steering wheel. Five and a six and a seven. Hey, big daddy. Ray Shea says hello from. <laughs> Ray Shea says hello from Des Moines, Iowa. My... 10 and 11 yeah, and a 12. Here. 13 and a 14 and a 15. I'm afraid I'm gonna fall in. And a 16. And a 17. And a 18. <laughs> and a 19. And a 20. And a 21. And a 22. And a 23. He's actually getting them, guys. And a 24. And a 25. And a 26. And a 27. And a 28. And a 29. Let's see if Fingerless Big Daddy can get any money, guys. <laughs> uh. oh, Alright, what did I get? I got one. Two, a little sponge step. Three, four. I got four out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think that fan's too, too high. I think we got slow. Alright, so. If somebody with no fingers can pull four dollars out of the cash cube, <laughs> that means the average person should be able to hit at least a twenty every time they get in there. Oh, this is fifty. Well, we threw fives in there though. There is fives in there for well, sure. I didn't see any of them. <laughs> All right. You want a you want a counterfeit marker to make sure they're real or? <laughs> All right. We owe you a five. I need a, a knife. Knife. All right. Ted, hold on, let me. You calling Ted? Yeah, I'm going to call Ted. Hold on. How about a public service announcement? Ted, what do you have to say? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go find some knife real quick. You got a knife, babe? Oh, you too, big daddy. That's a lot of work for four dollars. That's all I'm saying. That's not <laughs> That's a lot of work for a half a half a gallon of gas, or what? <laughs> and let's open the soft stuff. Right. Well, guys, uh, it's welcome to California. Uh, we pay seven dollars a gallon for gas, but it is fifty degrees outside. So, <laughs> I guess on a high note, you know, you, I'm not sure what you put the soft stuff in, so I got to wear something. Oh, here we are. Shared to Ray Shea, LOL. Thank you, Shay. Ooh, look at that oh, thing. Look at this. It's not, it's not even getting all the yeah. small. Oh, that's for bicycling. It, yeah, I mean, yeah, like I ride a bicycle. Uh, yeah, that's a bicycling uh, jersey. I drive it. And you got two of them. Is it two jerseys or is the pants in here? From shorts. Or Mary Ruth says hello, Annalisa. No, I got the shorts too. Oh, you got the padded bum. Yeah, look the at that. The shorts with a padded bum. I have a big shorts. You're, you're going to look professional on your bike now. On my bike. <laughs> You'll look professional if you drive, drive a bike. A truck. Good luck, Big Daddy. Oh, somebody, somebody, somebody shouted out for you. Hold oh, on. Oh, that's nice of them. I don't have. Good luck, Big Daddy from Ontario, Canada. Oh, now I can, now I can scrub my face. Hello, face. guys. What up, Bernie, Mandy, Amy says hi to everyone. What up, Amy? Oh, look Janet at this. Miller shared. My, well, I think, no, that's just a pillar. No, that's the that's for lint Please, on your yeah, coat, yeah. bro, or on your sweater. Could be on my bicycle shorts. Retail regulators, guys, unboxingmystery.com. I got two of them. 
You got two lint peelers? Yeah. Beautiful. Now I gotta go get some. I hope, I hope I got some milk in one of these boxes. Got blue skies and sunshine in Maine too. Right on, Cynthia. Two dollars for gas in Denmark. <laughs> yeah, right. Shared cool. to ten groups. Awesome. Oh, Appreciate you. Nice on me. Hey, what? Oh, is it? <laughs> Two dollars a liter? This is gonna look just lovely. Good afternoon, Vicky. How you doing? He didn't even keep oh, that one, guys. He didn't even keep that box. one. He threw it back. I got two in the right I got two in the <laughs> He threw it in the trash <laughs> box. I thought he was dumping it. What's up, Peggy Taylor? How are you? She says good luck. Sixty one degrees here in Kansas. Who's got the crappiest weather right now, guys? Come on, let's see it. Who's got the oh score time? Score time. I got a Nike box. Could it be Nikes or could it just be? Well, it looks like Nikes. Now let's see what size they are. God, that's way too big for you. You, you should just leave know. those here. He's a 12. Yeah, that's an adult size, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Master Plane, Master Plane. Gas is 370 in Maryland. Good luck from London, UK, New Hampshire in the house. Beautiful shoes, sir. Beautiful Nike Air Jordans. Gotta love them. I'm not open. Dee Sparrow says 51%, five in Ontario, Canada. We do raining. How much cost on one box? They're uh, 144 shipped or 99 in person. Carrie says 40 mile an hour wins. Patty has $4.60 gas in Washington State. That's good. That That's not bad. When it cracked five, I started getting a little sick, and now it's all the way up to God knows what. I don't even pay I attention anymore. My moles now. Nevis pin. Try it out, bro. Ted. <laughs> bring your moles over. <laughs> Ted, bring your moles. We have a steel pin. 382 in Florida. Negative three degrees in Denmark. I think negative three degrees in Denmark is going to win, guys. I don't think we can mess with that. 72 and rain but and thunder. Nothing's colder than the hearts of my female fans. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> all I can say. Uh, I think UK tops all other areas. Haha. -ha. We have sun, rain, and snow all and together on the same me. day. Allison decided she didn't want it. Al well, Allison is crazy, bro. What did Allison not want? Uh, Allison didn't. Oh, that's crazy. Wow, that's, that's that bling nice. blau right yeah. there. Maybe it's not the right size. This is a size four. Is it on the no, but that's a small size though. Yeah, man, that might that might have been. You got a little like tiny, tiny baby finger with that thing. What are you trying to say? <laughs> Stay to fit your baby finger, bro. <laughs> I still have a mail that box out to my sister. So like all this jewelry, they just keep. Uh, I, I, you can throw Alice in. Uh, snowy here in Northern Illinois. What up, Terry? 59 and sunny in Arkansas, 7 degrees Celsius in my area of Ontario, Canada. How come Kansas is called Kansas, but Arkansas is not called Arkansas? It's spelled just with an A-R in the front. <laughs> Anybody from Misery? <laughs> Anybody from Misery? I call it Misery simply because if you drive through there, the rumble strips are like on the wrong side. Oh, look at this. I got a... Ooh, what the heck is that? A thing. Ooh, what the hell is that, dude? Got a... Oh, I know what that is. Put it on the table. All right, I'm gonna put it on the table. It's got a motor here. It does plug into your computer, apparently. No. It has a computer. Does cable. it? That's a computer. That's a com VGA cable. Okay. And then you got these things. What the hell is it? And it's... Okay, what do you think of this? Uh, I was going to say it's a device for winding line on fishing poles or or it's for making cups. It's a high-speed lock-stitch sewing machine. High-speed lock-stitch sewing machine. Yeah. Never seen anything like it. Never heard anything like I it. I know, but it's... And it has absolutely nothing to do with fishing poles, but he tried but to make me line, feel good. Line, <laughs> he tried to line, make me feel good about myself. In there. <laughs> Some kind of it is a high-speed lock-stitch sewing machine. We're going to have to Google a picture on that. Well, it's a motor for one. Yeah, I don't think it's the whole and a thread stand for one. Right, I don't think it's the whole, the whole thing. Yeah. Are you a sewer, sir? I sell balloons. Oh, that's right. There it is, guys. This is our balloon pilot right here. He likes to come in every week and hang out with us. Yeah, big balloon skydive. There's his phone number right there. There's that beautiful, handsome face you guys all love to know and know to love. We'll get you up in the air. Yep. 
And let you jump out. <laughs> and let you jump you out. Get head up in the air. Uh, 69 in Wichita Falls, Texas. My husband is from St. Louis. It's raining and thunder and lights went out. What up, Paul? I hope the site is going to have some soon. All right, Tiff, that's what you were saying pretty pleased for. Um, so I'll pan you over. Uh, this is the last, absolute last pallet. I have them building it now. There's the residual of boxes. So we'll probably have some left. Uh, I might throw some up today. Make sure you guys signed up for the website for sure. Just because when I post them, people will jump on there and buy four or five at a time. So they like to like... These are the best solutions for digital and more. Ooh. Now they got to pay me for that commercial. Yeah, absolutely. You, know? you should get a spot for that, Big Daddy. I think... Uh, sure. It's a... Oh, an IP to ASI converter. Not sure what I can use it for, So but you have TV in your truck. Yeah, but I got TV in my house, too. <laughs> Look who's back, everybody. Kathy. Hi. Woo! <laughs> Uh, oh, this is a volumizer. Volumizer? Yeah. Can for you give us a demonstration? For a salon. I can get my hair to fluff up more. If I actually had it. This even has hair in it. Nice! That's nice. It comes with free hair. I was combing my dog with it. She's like, I didn't try this. <laughs> I just want to return it. With my hair in it. Good afternoon, Melody. What's happening? Kathy. Kathy hustled. She didn't need to volumize her hair for a wedding, so she bought Yay, it. Yay, Kathy, good to see you. She'll be up, guys. You know she can't stay away. I guess she's buying boxes for people today. To rechargeable ion lithium battery. What does that say? Xanax? Oh, my bad. <laughs> Release the crack tax. This is this is full of the taxes for crack. Crack tax. Crack tax. Cratex. Cratex. I have a. Um, so what is it? Four slot it. charger for nine volt rechargeable batteries. There's all your lithium ion uh, rechargeables. I have some. This actually might help because we got some. So that's more chargers. That's not just. Uh, this is batteries. Those are the batteries. That's a charger. charger. That's and this a charger. Is, this is a charger. Yeah. So what's in crack crack packs? I, I don't think it's actually. I think it's just something separate. I don't think it's. No, it looks like some kind of a. I don't want to open it because. Why? Because I think you should just throw it up and let's watch it pop in the air. <laughs> Well, that's exactly what it is, right? So it's like a little thing for the beach, or what is that? What do the batteries plug into? The batteries must be completely separate from this whole thing. They're just in the box. And then I got some stakes here that go on the ground to hold it down. So I guess, yeah, I guess it's for the beach. All right, I'll accept it. But now, how do you get it back down? Well, that's the challenge, bro. I mean, life can't be that easy. It's a day tent. Cool. It's 56 degrees in Des Moines. Beach tent. I need that. Helen Kirk wants to buy your beach tent. I don't know if she's a subscriber yet or not. Beach tent, fan, shade. Going to be there tomorrow with my belt and regulate. What's up, Larry? <laughs> hey, Larry's coming for you tomorrow, Ted. He's bringing, he's bringing his belt, he said. That's for the beach. Hang some lights inside and stick it in the yard. All right, she could come to the beach. She's going to have to come to the beach. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> and Donald Trump. 
<laughs> all right. Okay. Hey. Oh, <laughs> you get up, big guy. <laughs> and this is all the stuff people find in the uh, Amazon den. She's got Donald Trump holding her up, <laughs> doing the Trump dance. Ninety-three next week in Orange County. That's gonna be nice. Melody says, "Bring it, Larry." <laughs> what up, Helen? Ray Shay? Start at the top and twist down. They figured it out. They got it. Well, I didn't figure it out. He'll never get it on his own, but <sighs> that's gonna open up in the car. Watch. <laughs> it wasn't explosive. It didn't look too painful. Chargeable batteries are a good twenty bucks too. Uh, now, this one is about, I don't know, about 60 pounds. 60 pounds? Something. Okay. 60 pounds? It's pretty heavy. It's full of chains. I don't know what could be 60 pounds in that small. It's all metal, I'll tell you that. What was the tent brand? Uh, it looked like Kratax? Kratax? Oh. Ooh, it's a gigantic puller, bro. Oh, it's, a, it's a monster puller. Yeah, that's the money, yeah. It's a hydraulic puller. Yeah. I thought I was just going to get stuck with some piece of metal that I have no idea what it Dude, is. Dude, it's a hydraulic. Do you see the size of that thing, bro? I've never seen one that big. You feel, you feel proud of that? I've never seen one that big. You're supposed to say thanks, I get that a lot. <laughs> ah, this slow today. Uh, My fans know, though. The female ones. <laughs> Actually, most of the guys know, too, for some reason. What up, Nancy? 93 in Fresno. I need winter back. Thank you. Welcome to my shop. Hey, hey. They're never going to get your name right. A jack. It's not a jack. It's a puller. Uh, it uh, pulls bearings. Uh, it would basically separate two items. It's pretty cool. It was actually really cool. If you ever use mechanics tools or anything like that, it's uh, a lifesaver on some things. Ultimate guy item for sure. Mm -hmm. It seems like a something. It's got a little bit of weight. It looks like speakers possibly. No, it's not speakers. Oh, I know what it is. Might be an amp. The fucking oh, excuse my language. I did not say that. It's a gun safe for your center console. No, I lied. No, you lied. I lied. It's just a bunch of metal things. No, that's for the four x four uh, placements in the ground. So you put that, bolt those to the ground, drop the four x four posts in them, and you can make your little uh, canopy or your little outdoor patio shed. Those are the anchor oh. bolts that go into the concrete. They're about 25 bucks each. Oh, it only three. Wouldn't you put up four? Well, if you were trying to build an enclosure, I guess you would. But if you're just building the awning on the side of your house, oh, yeah. you're going to bolt those down and drop your studs and uh, make your header. Well, all right. all right. Well, you guys see what's going on here today, man. We got Kathy coming back in the house with three boxes. That's because it'll cost you 500 in the jar. <laughs> that cuss will cost you 500 in the jar. Yeah, I don't doubt, right? <laughs> Make me a garden, Big Daddy, says Beth. <laughs> I'm a garden. I'll send, I'll send Jay some pictures of my garden. <laughs> All right, guys. All I got guys. in my garden is tulips. We got Kathy and we got Margarita coming back. Yeah. She's going to do another one. Woo! <laughs> All right, guys. Give us a minute. We'll be back.